New at 530, highly controversial comments made by Ron Weiser, the chairman of the Michigan GOP, have some within his own party defending what he said. Thanks so much for sticking with us. I'm Alan Campbell. And I'm Amira David. It comes at a time that political rivals say he was advocating for violence. Simon Shaykat shows us why both sides remain at odds over his words. Michigan GOP chair Ron Weiser refused to talk on camera with us today about his recent remarks, but at the same time, the leader of a group of Oakland County Republicans is doubling down on what was said. Our job now is to soften up those three witches and make sure that when we have good candidates to run against them, that they are ready for the for the burning at the stake. In this public YouTube video provided to us by the North Oakland Republican Club president, state GOP chairman Ron Weiser calls Michigan Governor Gretchen Whitmer, Michigan Attorney General Dana Nessel, and Michigan Secretary of State Jocelyn Benson those three witches, and he mentions burning them at the stake. He also blasts Republican Congressman Fred Upton and Peter Meyer, who voted to impeach President Trump. Uh, other than assassination, I have no other way other than voting him out. The harsh tone prompting severe backlash from leaders in the Democratic Party, including the governor governor, the state attorney general, and secretary of state. But today, some in the Republican Party are taking the opposite position, calling those comments totally appropriate. What he was doing was very much similar to what a football coach would be doing to his team to rally them together to, for a victory. Matt Marco, president of the North Oakland Republican Club, denies Weiser meant to condone violence and says metaphors were taken out of context. It was refreshing to hear this kind of strong language, just similar to George Patton rallying his troops and like many others. A Republican state lawmaker from Monroe also weighing in. If we held everybody in the world with an important position for saying stupid things, there'd be nobody left to, to serve in government. That's a fact. I mean, I myself say stupid stuff all the time. I said something on the floor three weeks ago out loud. It was stupid. And I went to the lady the next day and apologized. In part of a statement, the head of the Oakland County Republican Party also saying, quote, we need to look at people's actions more than their words. That's what Democratic leaders have always told us. Now, even words taken out of context are part of their cancel culture. Ron Weiser, who still serves on the U of M Board of Regents, could not be reached by phone, nor at his publicly listed home address we visited here in Ann Arbor. In part of an apology Weiser issued over the weekend, he said, I apologize to those I offended for the flippant analogy about three women who are elected officials and for the offhand comments about two other leaders. I have never advocated for violence and never will. Today, we also reached out to several more Republican Party leaders and lawmakers for comment on Weiser's speech. They have declined to speak with us. Simon Shaykat, 7 Action News. Simon, thank you. A